hi you guys welcome to my channel my name is karen oddities or karen's oddities in this video i am unboxing these last two these are my last two the mcnugget buddies um i have two other videos where i unbox the other two that i have i will confess i did not get these through a mcdonald's meal purchase um my brother it wasn't me it wasn't my decision he went ahead and he placed an order online for like a full set. So he gave me the extra ones that he already had and that he didn't need to complete his set. He has a complete set. I don't. At some point I decided, you know what? I'm okay. I'm okay if I don't get a complete set. You know, I have, this will be four. So with these two, I will have four and I'm okay with that. I think there are, oh, I have cramps. There are six of them, but I'm okay if I only have four. So um, let's get into it. So he, I don't know what they are. I know that they have codes at the bottom. We've been here, done that. I'm not interested in the code. I'm interested in the surprise of what I've gotten. I know for sure I don't have Wafudu, which is one of the ones that I really wanted because she's like a princess. But um, Wafudu is at the bottom corner down here. So I know I don't have her. Uh, currently, I have Darla, who's at the right corner. She has a little earmuffs on. And I have Kerwin in the middle, which is the actual artist. So let's go with this one first. Who else did I get? You know, I should have grabbed the other one so I could show you guys um, the other ones that I have. And we could, like, mix match their bodies. I don't want to look at the card in here. I think I just saw it. <laughs> you guys did too. I don't want to look at it because I don't want it to give away who I have. So I did tell him, I'm like, don't tell me who they are. Because he knows all the little codes at this point. It better not be a duplicate or I'm going to use I really wanted this one. So this is the character that I feel like I relate to the most. Her name is Don Bernice. This is the one that I really, really wanted. And I'm really excited. I asked him, like, do I, am I getting Don Bernice? And he's like, I don't know, bro. You just go to open them and see. Don Bernice, girl. I'm sorry. Um, let's take off her afro. Okay, that's Don Bernice bald. This is so, this is me. This is me. I know I'm obviously not wearing my glasses right now, but this is, okay. Look at, if, <laughs> I'm an idiot, but if you just, if I had on my glasses right now, you guys would totally see the resemblance. This is me. I am her. Don Bernice and I are the same person. Right now my hair is straightened, but do you see the resemblance? I am Don Bernice. Um, she's so pretty. Okay, let's not get me and let's try to focus on. Look at how beautiful she is. Is that matte lipstick? Because that's what I like to wear. Not wearing any right now, but Don Bernice is beautiful. And she has eyelash extensions, as do I. And her glasses are so cute. If I was wearing my glasses, you guys would totally see the resemblance. But, like, let me do this one. This is too, <laughs> this is too funny to me. I wish I had someone to take a screenshot of this. This is so funny, but I'm going to try to do it with my phone afterward. Like, Don Bernice and I, which, let's be honest, all the McNugget Buddies have the same skin tone because they're chicken nuggets, and all chicken nuggets are golden brown like this. But we have the same... This, like, blends in. Okay, it doesn't... This totally... Kind of smells like... Kind of smells like a chicken nugget. Um, Don Bernice. We have the same skin tone. We are the same person, personality... This is her fit. She has a cape on. She has some pearls. Very fashionable. Very fashionable. High fashion. 
this is Don Bernice and I'm so happy that she is the one that I got because this is one that I really wanted. Honestly, at this point, I don't really care about the rest. But I'm going to read the card to you guys and then I'm going to open my last one. And then I need to go because I have the boys outside and it's snowing where I'm at. Um, so this is the little card that comes with her. Don Bernice. Okay, here she looks a little bit. Her skin looks a little bit melty. She looks a little bit older and a little bit tired. Kind of like me right now. I'm going to read the back and then I'll turn it around. Okay. So... Don Bernie, we even like the same nugget dip. Don Bernice dips in creamy ranch. She is wise and nimble with a needle and a thimble. She's stern. She gives stern advice, but she's always nice. And uh, she's been fitting the Frostway since 1955. So I can't do math, but... That's 45, 4, 5, 6. Damn. Is she 69? This is really going to suck. My math is really terrible, but 1955. Add a 50 to that is 2000. So it's 2005. So add a 50. And then add 19. She's 69. I can do math. It just takes me a minute. Um... I'm not a salad, but I be dressing. So Don Bernice, if I, um, why doesn't it say what her occupation is? I guess there's a description somewhere else. But when I read this, I'm like, I can totally relate to her. She seems sassy. She's into fashion. She's a fashion designer. We like the same dips. I'm wise as well. Um, I do give stern advice, but I'm nice for the most part. Don Bernice and I, we're the same person. Except I'm not 69 and I'm not really a fashion designer. But I always wanted to be a fashion designer. That was like always my thing. And I do like to dibble and dabble with like, I have a sewing machine that I got like two Christmases ago for my family. So um, let's readjust. So I do use that sometimes and I've created and designed some things. But this is Don Bernice. Let's go to the second one. I'm so excited to have her. She's such a cutie. She's such a cutie. Okay. Let's go to this next one. Oh, that sucks. You know what? I'm not, I don't care about the boxes. I'm not really, like, I don't care about the collectibleness. Yes, I know it's painful. I'm going to rip it. Um, again, not going to look at the card because I want to be surprised. I'm going to put it face down. I know who this is and I'm so sorry. I'm such a piece of crap for doing this. But I know who this is. And I'm so happy with this one too. If I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. Oh, uh, I have the perfect set. I have the perfect freaking set, you guys. If I'm not mistaken. Okay. This is Uptown Mo. Okay, I think. Um, let's see. Yeah. I have the coolest ones. I have the coolest ones. The only one that I would have. Okay, let, let me focus on Uptown Mo. This is Uptown Mo. Uptown Mo, my understanding is he's a construction worker. Oh, you can put, can you put his cap? Oh my goodness. You can put his McDonald's cap backwards. Oh shoot. This is him bald. Can you put it to the side? Kind of. Uptown Mo looking kind of cool. Kind of thuggish. Can you put it up like those people that wear their hats like this? Yes. Okay, then brows is intense. Um, we're going to put this hat on. We're going to put this hat on Don Bernice in a minute. And we are going to switch it up in a second. Oh, I'm having a challenge here with my terrible setup. So, 
yeah this is uptown mo he's a construction worker i believe as you can see there's a buildings there's a transit that looks like um it looks it could be a subway i don't know but this is uptown mo this is his body this is his face Now, what happens when I do this? Oh, they're so, look at them. They're so cute together. Let's put an afro on Uptown Mo. Let's see what. And she's so fashionable. Yeah. Bernice! I. I love her in this look. Like, honestly, I feel like I need to run and go get my other two so I can, like, switch up their looks. But, baby, this is a look. Um, Uptown, is this Uptown Mo? I think this is Uptown Mo. Uh, I just, I don't really care for his face. He looks like a Cabbage Patch doll. But she looks cool. She knows fashion. Don Bernice, we're gonna leave you with this hat on. I know your afro is beautiful as well, but I just feel like this is such a look with your cape. It's giving McDonald's, it's giving Queen, it's giving yes, educated, sophisticated with the pearls, it's giving money, it's it's giving everything. This is my alter ego McNugget buddy. Now let's read Uptown Moe's description. So this is his cardo. Why are their faces? Whoever designed these, maybe it was like AI, but uh, that looks ugly. It, they look like they're melting, but I guess that's what you're gonna look like, right? They have like weird. Okay, so anyway, um, Uptown Mo. His dip is spicy buffalo, which I don't think I've had. Um, he's a motivational speaker and a tough love specialist. His heart of the city, Frostway's finest, and he carries the block on his back. Keep your ears to the street and your eyes to the sky. That is a really cute saying. I will say that's really cute, Uptown Mo. I can totally dig that. Um, Focusing. I can totally dig that. So. There you guys have it. Um, this is my final um, unboxing of McNugget Buddies. So I have Don, I almost called him Don Bernice because he's wearing the Afro. I have Uptown Mo, who's now not wearing his hat, wearing um, Don Bernice's Afro because he's bald and he needs to keep his head warm anyway. And we have Don Bernice. Um, she is the fashion designer and she's the one that I really, really wanted that I relate to the most. I also have Darla. Um, Darla, what does Darla do? I think she's a singer. She's like a performer. And then I have Kerwin, which is obviously the artist behind this campaign that McDonald's ran. The McNugget Buddies are gone. I'm sure you can find them online. They're pretty expensive from what I understand. The two that I don't have is... Mr. Frost, oh, not Mr. Frost, Brick and Wafudu. I did want Wafudu because she's a princess. Um, and I mean, I'm a princess. If you didn't know, I'm a princess. Um, I wanted her, but I'm okay without those two. You know what I mean? Like, I'm really happy with the four that I have. And my brother did say, he's like, you're going to be really happy with your set, even though it's not a full set. I did not get the golden McNugget buddy, like the special ultimate one, which is essentially, if I'm not mistaken, it's literally a nugget like this. I can't remember what the face looks like, but it's like covered in gold. Obviously not real gold, like plated paint gold. Um, I did not get that one. And you know what? I'm okay with it. I told my brother at some point when I saw on YouTube, someone else posted, they got it. I was like, um, I need you to get this for me. And he's like, bro, it's like $75. And I'm like, Okay, get it for me, though. Obviously, he didn't get it for me, and I don't want him to waste his money on that because it's not that serious at the end of the day. Had I gotten it randomly, that'd be pretty freaking cool. Um, but, I mean, they're obviously, it's even more rare than 
some of these other characters. So I hope you guys enjoyed my unboxing of my final two McNugget buddies. Um, yeah, and I hope if you guys are collecting them or if you guys collected them, you got the ones that you really wanted. And if you didn't, I hope that you go and you order them and don't feel bad about it. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. Stay safe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much.